Evening, everyone. It's uh, 7 to 15 on Sunday night, the 23rd, and uh, this is your futures look for this evening. Uh, let's just get right to it. It's video number 1118. Okay, so uh, oil is up a little, heating oil is up a little, gasoline is up a little. And that gas is down a little. I'm probably going to add to that position in UNG. Uh, the gold is up 280. Silver is up a half of a penny. Copper is up a little. Uh, platinum and palladium basically unchanged. Over to uh, stocks, we are up about uh, $19 in the uh, S&P, 98 and a quarter, 99 now in the NASDAQ, and 121 in the Dow. Uh, the dollar is a little bit stronger, and uh, bonds are down uh, about a third of a dollar. Uh, the most interesting here is the cryptos, which are again lower. Um, on Friday, we were down as low as 31, uh, 36,150 and rallied back to close 2,000 higher at 38,180. Tonight, we have gapped down and through that, uh, touching 35,000. 425. Uh, right now we're down $1,935 and uh, it looks, you know, I wouldn't have expected it, but it looks like we may have a shot at closing this gap down to, uh, let's see what that number actually is, 32930 And while we've already rallied off the low here, the low for uh, Bitcoin has been 35,004 and a quarter, and we're 800 off that right now. Um, it clearly wouldn't take much after this break on Friday to see it come back in and maybe test that level. Uh, Ethereum is the same situation. Uh, it uh, has tried to rally, but it's down 215 right now. And its chart looks, you know, pretty much the same. Um, except that when it left this little gap to the upside, it actually came down the next day and closed it. There is another one here uh, between um, 2095 and 2151. Not very far from here. Uh, but again, the same situation. Uh, it was down as low as 2550. It rallied 200 off the low to close 2736, even though it was down 450. And tonight it has been lower, but it's still down 217. Um, as far as the gold goes, um, as I said, uh, we're down. We're up about three dollars, which is nothing overwhelming. But uh, you know, as long as we can stay above this 1830, 18 that close that I was talking about, 182860. Um, if we can ride this five-day moving average back up and close over. Uh, 1843.20, um, I could definitely see us in the 1860-1870 area. All right, everyone, that's all I have for you tonight. I'll be back first thing in the morning with a pre-open.